I think technology kind of found me when I started in accounts payable 20 years ago in a telco in Dublin and um, my career has evolved ever since. I always enjoyed all the STEM subjects in, in school so um, the technology careers were the most challenging at the time and I, I decided to embrace that challenge and I haven't regretted it. Um, I was working in the hotel industry and I wanted a change of career so I took up a position and um, I knew it was a side move um, but it was one of the best things I ever did. I did computer science and DIT and uh, I kind of fell into a job and it was amazing. I absolutely loved it. Super good at it, I think. I hope. Technology is really fast paced, it's a bit crazy, um, but it's ever evolving, so um, you're never bored. It also allows you to be on top of the latest uh, technologies and um, really uh, seeing how technology can improve everybody's lives. I'd say very challenging, uh, forces you to expand your horizons. You always have to try and consider the unexpected while also planning for everything you know will go wrong and then a couple of extra things. That's kind of tough. Very exciting and fun. Sometimes people may think that they need to be highly technical to even think about going into the tech industry and I don't believe that's the case. I think actually um, the more people that kind of go in that maybe are not that way inclined um, enhances the diversity of thinking in the organisation. So it's always good to see how being a woman brings a different uh, perspective to, to the whole uh, technology area. Just go for it. Uh, figure out exactly where it is you want to work in technology and you'll have lots of people supporting you along the way. Um, women are so welcome and it's always nice to see um, women join the tech force. My name is Beatrice Alonso and I'm the head of Test and Team. I'm Gillian French, I'm the Chief People Officer. I'm Imogen Fitzgerald and I'm Test Team Lead on Software and Web Apps. I'm Mary and I'm a woman in tech in Cubic Telecom.